So what we're looking at here is something that I hope will become special. It already is pretty special. I know a lot of you, well, I don't know this, but I'm guessing many of you went through COVID. Some of you had it, some of you escaped it, but it was a lot of anxiety for myself. I did catch a pretty bad case and was locked down in my house, which is normally not a big deal, but you start to go bonkers after a while and was really thinking what to do. And what you're seeing here is what is going to become the cutout, the silhouette of Carol Shelby. Let's see the contour. I think it was cut, I think one and a half inch plywood. Now, sorry for the hand there. This part looks odd, but eventually the idea is to add, integrate some sort of bottle opener maybe a machined open end wrench and then what will happen is I just hit my hand I will send this out to a local artist buddy and he will paint it he will finish it and then we will present it as a wedding gift to a friend of ours for his man cave and hopefully his wife will approve i'm sure she will um just looking at this i should have made the hat bigger but uh we'll work through it and like i always say there is more to the story so it's moving along the progress is moving along but if we move around here i am from Indiana okay more specifically in this area and I promise you this is the story is going someplace to so just hold with me on this so how did I get from here down to here which is actually me interviewing Carol Shelby, it's a picture. So what I'm gonna do is tell the story of the picture later on, but this is how the dots connect from Indiana to back over to what inspired me and what helped me get through a nasty stretch of COVID when you don't know what to do, just be creative. So here's another look. Up and down, there's his cowboy boots. Probably he'll end up in some sort of uh, black, design this is a probably an older carol i don't think it would really be a lamar carol this will be the tricky part fixing the bottle opener but i think that's gonna really help it out so when this gets going i will keep you posted as always stay positive Stay with me and I hope you enjoy this story of, well, I guess it's going to be resiliency and uh, how one thing can lead to another. Thank you for watching.